With the map design complete, I can create a legend and then export the map to a PDF for use in Inkscape. So I'll start by opening a print composer. I'll go to the project menu, new print composer, and I'll name this Worldwide IDPs and Refugees. And in the composition tab, I'll set some properties for my map. I'll set the presets to ANSI A letter, keep the orientation as landscape, and I'm going to click the change button on page background and make this completely transparent and click OK. And I'm going to make sure that print as raster is unchecked. Now I'll add the map to the canvas and make it the same size as the page. So I can go to the item properties and under position and size set the X and Y origin to zero and change the width to 279.4 and the height to 215.9 which fills the page size with the map. I'm going to use the move item content button and drag my map content so that it's in the middle of the page and I'm also going to uncheck background on my map properties so that the background is transparent. Next I'll add a legend. I'll need to change some basic legend properties before I dive in much deeper. So I'm going to go to the item properties for my legend, remove the title, scroll down to the background and uncheck that to make it transparent. Expand fonts and enter the subgroup font category and set this to Arial, size 11, click OK. Next I'll choose the item font and I'll change that to Arial as well and make this size 10. And now I'm going to go in and change the font color. I'll click the drop down, open up choose color, and I'll change this to a hue saturation value of 0, 0, 100. And click OK, which makes it white. And finally I'll expand symbol. I'm going to set this at 6 by 4, which just adjusts the patch size of my symbols in my legend a bit. Okay, now I'm going to work with the content of the legend. There's a couple layers that don't need to be in here. The graticules and the ocean are self-explanatory and I can remove those from the legend. So I'm going to uncheck auto update and this allows me to change the contents of the legend. Next I'll select the graticules 15 degrees layer and click the remove button to remove that from my legend. And I'll do the same for the ocean layer. I'll also want to adjust the name for refugees. So I can select that name and click the edit button. And I'm going to change this to UNHCR Assisted Refugees to make it more accurate. I also want to select this no data class and click the down arrow to move it as the bottom class. Next I'll select the Pakistan class and I'll move this to be just above the no data class. This orders the data in the legend from the lowest number of refugees to the highest number of refugees. With that done, I'm going to grab my legend and move it over the Pacific Ocean just west of South America. To finish, I'll export the map as a PDF. So I'll go to the Composer menu, Export as PDF, navigate to my Lab 6 data folder, and I'll name this Worldwide refugees, and IDP population. In the next task, I'll design the map layout using Inkscape.